and a year of creativity. A seasonal guide to what? I need to see what that's about. Hey, good morning. It's um, first thing in the morning. It was probably about 7.30 in the morning, my time. I don't know. And I'm still in my gown. It's one of my ballerina gowns. I'm not going to show you the whole thing because, uh, yeah. And uh, it's one my sister gave me. So thank you, Gina. I came down to do my, um, pack up a couple of things I sold on eBay. When the, the storm hit, we had to move everything from this corner because we got, and I got it, yeah, I got it. We got a leak. It's uh, water was is seeping through our wall. That's like a cinder block wall, you know, and we have a flower bed over here. So we're gonna have to dig it out and seal that brick and all the cinder block and everything. So yeah, got that going. So everything that was kind of piled up over here ended up all over here, yes. I know I'm moving really fast, but here is the fun thing I wanted to show you. So that's good. So this is kind of, hey, I should show while I'm in here, I need to dig some stuff out. So this has sort of become my little nightmare. I just lost some, some stuff. So this is filled with two things, primarily scrapbooking and jewelry. And obviously I haven't gotten to either one in quite a while because I blocked the doorway. Oh, there, yeah, and there goes that. So I have some really cool stuff in here. I really need to pull on my scrapbook stuff. I know I'm not gonna scrapbook. I'm just not gonna do it. It's not my thing. I thought it would be a thing. It's not. And a year of creativity. A seasonal guide to what? I need to see what that's about. That's so cute. <laughs> I forgot I had this. Don't you love this? I have this really cool card. I mean, why is that in here? I need to give that to somebody. Hopefully, I don't have to give that to somebody because I'm hoping everybody is well. Anyway, I know I'm moving really fast. It's morning and I got stuff to do. I got it. I came down here. Once again, ADD kicks in. I am supposed to be um, <laughs> getting something ready to ship. I love these things. I actually use those a lot. But uh, someone who, uh, Edwin, i just go ahead and name you out. When you are talking, when you were saying something about um, doing some collage, I was inspired to come down and just see what I kind of had down here as far as uh, books or whatever. Oh, that was my cat. She passed away. She was old. She's like 19 years old. Um, but I kept it because I'm always buying the old jewelry. And then the rhinestones, you know, with missing rhinestones. So any chance you get to find, any chance, I'm going to get this out. If you like to do some jewelry like I do, and you find weird pieces like this with the good rhinestones, grab them because rhinestones are awesome. And you can replace them. In fact, most of the stuff here is goodie bag finds that I just stuck in the little holes, in the little holes in my doors. I just drop stuff down. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's why it gets to be a big pile. Oh, puka shells. Who doesn't love a good puka shell? So if somewhere in my sad imagination, I think one of these days I'm going to have time to do all the stuff I want to do. I thought these would make cute little ornaments for a mini tree. And so I was going to take it apart and bead some, you know, jewelry. I mean, I'm sorry, take this jewelry apart and bead some ornaments. But I really don't have a lot of choices on this. I would only have a few, but look at that guy. He's so funny. Yeah, the, there's another idea. Yeah, so that's just that. Yeah, beads. Full of beads. Oh, that was pretty cool. That is actually a bracelet that is copper wire and green beads. And it's awesome, but it is deadly. It, it catches on everything. And it's the little end right there, I don't know if you can see it. That is so sharp. Never made it do a real terrible job. Oh my gosh, so many cool beads. I love these beads. This is sick. This is, you know, the hoard, and then the fact that I just bought more stuff, which I'm gonna kind of incorporate back into here. One thing I love are these these jars. They're so cute. These are old, like, you know, sample jelly jars. I have a whole bunch of them that I got in Rolling Hills. I'm talking like, oh yeah, just tons. If you look up 
here there's a bunch up there there's different sizes but these were my favorite these were cute which i've not paid anything in saving those for something special oh yeah i have more bags i think i mentioned these in an earlier video uh, that i did where i took um cedar shavings and lavender and mixed it together and made these bags and i put them in when i put my sandals and things away in storage i have you know, like a bunch of these bags in there kind of layered in there to keep you know bugs and stuff out of course it keeps them smelling fresh when i take them out so nice uh wire so this the majority i'm talking majority as in 90 percent probably our thrift store finds, even including the wire I have here. All this bag of stuff probably came from the thrift store purchase. Goodie bag kind of thing. There. Yeah, fun stuff. So, yeah, I came down here to pack up something. And look what I found myself doing. Playing in my cabinet. Who knows? Yeah, this is all. Um, these are so cute. I wish I would like that too. I'm always thinking of a girl. Oh, don't eat. Oh, this is you stick them in your. Yeah, I know what those are. Those are like pouches you put in your paper. I love mounting corners, as you can tell. I grab them every time I see them. Lots of good markers that are really going bad just sitting in here. I I need to find these in the home. I'm going to have to call her over and say, come here. Go through this. Take everything you want. Look at all these goodies. Lots of stickers. Oh, and templates. Lots of templates. Yeah, it's a thing. It's a. I, I understand. I mean, most of this came from Rolling Hills. This is a really cool set. They are. Um, it's like watercolors. First church thrift store, I believe. Yeah, so those are fun. These are just the uh, letters. Somewhere I have a stamp pad, I suppose. I think I got these on clearance at, um, I guess I can imagine spending big money on that. Oh, yeah, this is the one that you make, you write your, um, you enter your, I can't even talk. You put together your letters and you make your own stamps. Never used. I think I just bought it because it was on sale. Yeah, that's that whole, that whole hoarding thing. Does You do that. Oh, these are cool. These are, I'm sure, dried out. Sorry about all the moving. This is another really cool bunch of papers. Oh my lord. My husband wants to sell this big old piece. He doesn't realize how I'm utilizing it. But we have to get it out of the way. So I actually, there's method to my madness today. And that is to see what kind of boxes I need to find. To throw all the stuff in. And when I say boxes, I mean cardboard boxes out of my... Cool and lots of good paper. All the stuff that I get, mm, all the stuff that I get, I uh, it's because I found it on clearance. The world. Oh, it's the letters. But the beads are kind of organized up there. They're actually <laughs> so organized, y'all. There's a million beads. There's a, there are so many pounds of beads. It's incredible. Wow, lighting is so much better now. This is just one of those little clip lights. All right, I found these things in at, at uh, Goodwill for 99 cents. I can't open it with one hand. It's one of the, oh yeah, I can. I love these. These are so awesome. It's for putting, um, you know, your really cool beads. They're very special. So that was exciting. That's a good find. I haven't used it. Uh, these are just, you know, save all your medicine bottles. Four. 
Yeah, when you're with fibromyalgia, you take a lot of medication. Uh, anyway, this is a good place to store. Also, when you're selling them uh, on eBay, if you have some beads you're selling on eBay, that's a good thing, too. Uh, these things are always handy. The only thing I don't like about them is they tend to crack when they get older. Hopefully, we can get up here. So, I don't really like that. So, let's see. Another thing. Whoops. Rolling Hills finds, you know, the new jewelry that they got in. So, I got these. Um, one deal's fine and pretty cool. So, I'm gonna put some special beads in there. I don't even know what I've got. Like I said, been throwing things in. Oh, okay. So, here's something really cool. I'm gonna show y'all. Um, I got all these old rook cards. I bought a pair of earrings that was at a thrift store, and I thought it was the cutest thing. They took old cards like this, and this is what they put the, their, you know, punch two little holes in, and they would hang the jewelry on these, on, you know, old cards. So I'm just digging these really old rook cards that are rough like that. And that was my plan. And then the, these are pretty cool, too. I mean, they're, they're newer, but I, I like the old ones the best. But I hung on to them anyway. Anyway, I went through the cards to see, and yeah, I'm missing some cards so that I have no, no guilt whatsoever. I have one gold wooden bead. Uh, where I'm going to put you? This, look at this. Full. Now, a lot of this is stuff I don't think I would keep. I So, I really kind of need to go through. I want to, this is plastic. I have some pretty creative ideas to do with that. Hmm. We'll see how that works out. Guys, no kidding. Bags and bags and bags of jewelry. Bags. Embarrassing. Oh, put that with the, that stuff. And then these. You get these adorable little things like this. And you think, well, I'm going to carry that around, do some sketching or note writing. Yeah, doesn't happen. And it ends up in here. I love this. I actually bought this for my son. Uh, and he, oh, he bought it maybe. I think I bought it. But I thought it was really cool. But he didn't, he didn't keep it. He's not much of a writer. Yeah, I got to find a home for these. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I was going to stop his eye. I said, why is he in here? He's missing an eyeball. And there you will stay forever waiting. Shark teeth. Look at the shark teeth. Oh, okay. So here, right here are the other ones. Yeah, I knew I bought more than pin bags. Look at this. I found three of these. And they were all 99 cents each. I just pulled tags off of the others. So that's just <laughs> needs to be utilized. Sometimes I thought one was bigger. Maybe not. I don't know. It's just fancy. It's just something fancy. And then, you know, sometimes fancy things are fun. And I actually have... What is all this? I have a, oops. Oh, here's some jewelry I was trying to work on. So that's up there. I I have some just uh, of those jars somewhere in my stash of stuff. But yeah, look at all my... Uh, all my beads. And this goes way back in there. <laughs> These are cool too. Okay, so these are spice jars. If you're looking for creative ways, which I can't see what I'm doing right now. If you're looking for creative ways to store your beads, find old spice jars like these. I mean, that is so cute. And that was something I did because I'm just so creative. I have a whole bunch of sequins. I don't know what I'm going to do with those sequins. So let's see what's in this bag. Oh, yeah! I did. No, see, I knew I bought some of these. Okay. So I thought these were so cool. These were at the dollar store. Four for a dollar. Oh, whatever. You know, they're a dollar bag, and this is a four. I thought they'd be awesome, but then you can't see what's in it. Beads, beads. More stuff for scrapbooking. It's in the bag. What's in the bag? Uh, okay, are these urine cups? They are. Okay, this is Rolling Hills finds, by the way. I hope they weren't used. There's that. This whole bag is full of just stuff from Rolling Hills. Uh, sequins. Yeah, okay. Is this my sequin? So I just stuffed everything. Sequins. And you know, see, all that came together. So this was all Rolling Hills bag. A big old bag of goodies. Uh, more bag of bags. A bag of bags. Look at this. 55 cents for all these um, jewelry bags. Oh, and oh, me and my zippy bags. 55 cents for all these zipper bags. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh, you know what I should do? I'm hanging on those. This would be great for Barbie shoes. Putting that over there. I mean, keep track of my Barbie shoes. Do that. I'm going to look through 
Oh, no, I didn't look through this bag. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Oh, oh my gosh. That's an, oh, put that, there. that is an earring. Is that the weirdest thing? Look how weird that is. It's huge. I really like it. I think my wings backwards again. Hang on. Yeah. So that is like the coolest earring. I think it would be dangerous for me to wear. And the, okay, so here's an example. It's all beat up. Uh, find why you should always hang on to all the uh, little things you find because you can glue them back together. This is missing a lot though. I think this is one to scrap because it's so far gone. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is the one with the toe and things. Uh, weird wooden shelf. Uh, oh, this is oh, this was glued to something. That was glued to something. Anyway, hey, I hang on to it. What else? You know, you know me. I hang on, hoard it up. I don't care. Oh, that is an old piece. Look at that. Isn't that fun? And it, the pen is worked. Why is this in here? I should clean that up. Oh, it's missing a stone, I think. Oh, what's the, what's, where's, now see, here's what happens. You got to get all this stuff together. I threw the dog collar in here somewhere. So, yeah, and I know for a fact, I would never be able to find a stone that's got this much weather to it that these do. Yeah, so this is just some fun stuff. Oh my gosh, I've got to sort. Who doesn't love a good sorting project? So, this bag, I think I have opened it. This bag was $1.55, and look at all the goodies I got. I love these. These are pretty cool. These are... If they're in here, chances are they're glass, except I'm pretty sure these are plastic, and I just haven't sorted through them. So, I do tend to go through and get rid of all the plastics. Uh, those pearls may be plastic as well. I think I just haven't sorted through this. I may pull some stuff out, but didn't really get involved. But I'm digging this bracelet. It seems to be broken. I don't know why I would leave it in there. Unless it's, I don't know. Maybe it's plastic. <gasps> more, more bags for dog. There you go. Put, put the Barbie stuff eventually. So you can see, I can get down here. And I can waste all day long playing in my, in my, oh, hang on. A little ADD there. Hang on. There's my other ones. All right, you, got, you got to go somewhere else, man. Put that in a file. Yeah, here are my big ones that I've had a little bit longer, so they better be used. Yeah, so check it out. So aren't these fun? Not that any other stuff is precious or anything. It's just stuff. That's an earring that is um, a porcelain. Um, Well, not porcelain. I'm sorry. Yeah, maybe. The ceramic. One of those things. And some really cool beads like that. <laughs> So they're cute. Look how cute it is to look down on your little goodies. Little ducks. And that's what I do. I think it's just like yeah, the people who love collecting all the scrapbooking stuff. It's the joy of um, sorting through them. Look at these. They're like eyeballs. So funny. I mean, they really do. What were they supposed to be? They are, they're eyeballs. Uh, this is actually one of my bracelets that I bought at a, a craft um well, we have a, what's it called, a peach festival, and then they have all the little craft things set up. Uh, I love the beads. on it. The, the skull always stays to the side, so I really don't like that. So I need to find a new way to display them. But it's a really cool bead, and I bought it because it was someone I knew. And it's been nice. I bought something. And who could, who could pass up a good skull? Come on. You know me. Uh, oh, yes, I got a piece of art back here hanging up. I forgot. You don't even get to see it. I need to pull it down so you can see it. Yeah, okay, this is a macrame board. How funny is that? Old, vintage. Oh, my gosh. This whole bag, this whole bag is. Ugh, that stuff. Um, that's a different size paper, though. I don't know what that's about. Oh, these are so good. Okay, so this is cute, and I should keep that with those. Um, I've got so many pony beads somewhere that those are, I think these are findings. So I see how I look when I'm better lit. Does that work? Except for the glow. So you can kind of see what I'm using in my glasses. So that's some crazy thing. Hey, these things are great, and then you can adjust the lighting on them. So I have it kind of down low because I was... If you can find the button, I had it down low, so let's try. Okay, that's low, that's medium, oh my God, and that's high. No, it's off. Okay, that's low, medium, and high. So, oh, well, makes my skin just glow so beautifully. Anyway, I... Uh,
Hey, stay, thanks for sticking with me this far. Keep watching. There's some more fun stuff to come.